Hey guys, it's Deligracy here, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4 Barbie Season 3, Episode 18. And in the last part, we had Lamassi age up, so we have just moved Topaz, Nita, Lamassi, and the toddlers uh, to a brand new house that we built in San Maishuno. They're now going to be living in an artsy boho apartment. So if you guys want to see that speed build, I will put that link on the screen for you guys uh, so you can check it out. But anyways... I love this apartment. It's finally on the gallery. I took quite a while to upload it, but I, but I think it's going to be perfect for them. So yay. Anyways, we've just started off and logged into the game and uh, it says to select a branch for Topaz Roberts. Yay. He's finally getting to uh, like a higher level in his career at last. So he can be a comedian or musician. He's always wanted to be a comedian. A musician has been an uh, amethyst thing. Sorry, I just had a banana and I have a little bit of a suggestion. Uh, comedian, the life of a professional comedian isn't all funny business. So practice those impressions and prepare your best uh, topical jokes. Rewards include the ability to try out material in front of friends. Woo! 67 buckaroonies an hour, 2 p.m. to 8 p.m. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday off, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Wait. Are they read the off days? I assume that he's working four days a week. Um, but I'm just going to show you guys this lovely apartment. So we are in the art district. It's not too far away from Barbie and Ken, which is nice. Uh-oh, we got a little bit of music on here. Oh, actually, where's the sound in this game? I think I turned off my sound. There we go. Like, I can see the neighbors are being noisy, but I can't hear the noise. There we go. Uh, you know what? Let's get Topaz to go out here and to knock politely. I don't think he's going to be rude about it. Um, it looks like there's some romance festival, I'm judging. Amethyst, congrats on the big promotion, Topaz. Do you want to celebrate tonight? Oh, my God. Yes. Um, oh, what? No, but I want to show you guys the apartment. Okay, we will, I'll show you the apartment afterwards. <laughs> but he can go out, have a little bit of fun, and uh, maybe we'll get, um, well, I guess Lamassi's aged up, so she can probably look after her siblings. So we'll get Nita to come out. Uh, we'll get Diamond. We'll leave Barbie at home. We just want the, the youngins, the over, the over 18s, um, perhaps is appropriate. Yeah. Yeah. Where's Jem? Why isn't Jem invited? Oh, wait. I just clicked on Jem. Who am I missing? I think those are the main siblings who have aged up. Yeah. Okay. So they can have a little bit of a party time. Uh, but yeah, uh, I do have some feedback from you guys as well. There are a few comments that I thought were really good. Uh, so I'll just get those up. Um, one from Baby Doll Sims got 636 thumbs ups and 18 replies, which I thought was like, whoa, nice one. Uh, God, the comment is, God, Ruby really is the ultimate middle child. She has four older siblings and four younger siblings, and all of her other siblings have a partner sibling growing up, and she had no one. Maybe when Ruby becomes a young adult, her life aspiration could be a serial romantic because she never had a companion growing up, and so when she's older, she actively looks for someone to complete her. And she could go through multiple partners, partly because I imagine she'd get bored of people so quickly. And because she's never taken responsibility for her own actions, she could be really irresponsible with woohooing and fall pregnant a few times. Love that, baby doll sims. And um, the other one I really liked was It's Lily said Ruby should go out one night and see Akash with his side girl and tell Amethyst. But Ruby, who's, it should be Ruby who says something because... She's unsure whether Amethyst would believe her. It's the sort of thing that Ruby would joke about. It's like, damn! I like it. Anyways, let's go celebrate. Uh, where are we? We are in, okay, San Myshuno. We are at the club. You know, these sims still need to go out and have fun, even though they've started families. So, um, yeah, let's just all dance together. Just celebrate. And uh, let's say hi to Jim. Uh, Goof around a little bit with his bro. Just have a little bit of fun tonight. I mean, it's 11 o'clock at night. They are going out quite late. <laughs> it's it's kind of late to start the night. Oh, actually, not really. I mean, you kind of go out at, what, 10? Amethyst looks so cute in this outfit. Uh, I love her sense of style. I love her hair. Well. That hair is that <laughs> makes me love it. Um, are you goofing around or are you being rude, Topaz? Oh, bangers. Bangers. 
I feel like he's totally interested in Gem in like a man way. Oh, 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 um, where's Nita? Did Nita come down here? Did Nita even come out? Where's she? Where's my gal? Oh, she's over here. I want her and Topaz to be a little bit romantic because I didn't really get that much time to, to flirt and embrace and uh oh somebody go, gonna go to the toilet let her go do that and she's pretty tired as well so we won't have a late night just a just a sneaky bug it's always a good time i feel like this is what jeff does like every night of the week just a party boy <laughs> Diamond's like, oh, haven't been out there so long, but she's a, she's, well, she technically is a single lady now, so she could, she could pick up some boys. She would usually be way more dressed up than this, though. I feel like uh, she, she isn't as dressed up as she usually is. And Topaz, I wouldn't mind Topaz getting a drink from the bar, um, a celebratory drink. Let's order a drink. Let's order a drink for group and we'll get, oh no, not the plasma. The plasma always looks delicious and pink, but I'm like, mm, I don't think they're gonna drink plasma. Oh, it's it's really 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 oh no, what? He's feeling flirty. Oh no, 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 wait, that's the bartender. He's gonna collapse soon. He's so exhausted. This was a silly idea to go out. Oh my God, how many people are in their group? This guy is, just, oh, these guys are just getting free drinks. They, they're not really part of our group. You're not part of the family. Oh, that's so sneaky. So, so sneaky. Oh, look at him. He really needs to just go to bed. Poor dear. Poor, poor dear. Oh well, at least they can all have a drink. Say cheers. And uh, then they can head back home. Wow, nice one. I am. Um, I actually had a Long Island iced tea on the weekend. It was so nice. It was delicious. You have to be really careful there because Long Islands can be extremely strong. So, um, but this one was a really nice one. Okay, Topaz. What is he doing? Is he chatting with Amethyst? I feel like he's wandering around. He doesn't know where he's going. He looks like a deer in headlights. He's like, what am I doing here? Okay, I mean, ordering drinks together. Let's just go get your drink. Just who cares if the others don't have a drink? Every man for himself. Amethyst, you can grab a drink if you want. But, um, and Nita, did Nita get a beverage? She wanted to chat to Topaz. Oh, she looks upset. She's like, I miss my babies. I miss my boy boys. Uh, Okay. And I think I want to have like a kiss. I want to well, confess attraction. I'm pretty sure they know they love each other. Pretty sure they're kind of past that stage now. I mean, look. Oh my gosh. Okay, honey buns. This is your moment. This chick is always out. She's like the party girl. Always hitting the town. Oh my god, there's so many things, so many people wanting to talk to Topaz. It's like the man of the hour. I mean, he got a promotion, but is it really that big a deal? Gem's gonna pee his pants. Don't break the seal, Gem. Don't do it. <laughs> Alright, where's... Oh, I don't know. I think we should head home. Oh, Amethyst looks so classy. She's just like... Oh, she's just so gorgeous. Alright, let's head home. Um... Oh, well, time's nearly up though, so maybe we'll just maybe we'll just go to the end. All right, Topaz, speak to your woman. Boys, Okay, why won't he talk to her? Like, come on. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
Oh, finally, finally that gang romantic. Okay, good stuff. I mean, it's hard to find the time, I guess, but you gotta keep the love alive. This is how. Oh, try for baby in the closet. I don't think they need any more kids at this stage. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love getting them to all have babies, but I feel like we've had a lot of babies in this LB. <laughs> oh my god, these guys are such cute parents! I love them! Oh, uh -huh. so sweet, passionate kiss. I love these guys. Um, an offer of rose. Oh, with Vorb. Char. Oh, cute. All right, you two lovebirds, let's get you home. It is 3.20 in the morning on a Tuesday. Are you kidding on our man, bish? Because uh, even though your name is Jade, you will never be part of the Barbie family, girl. You ain't taking us from two bars. Mm -mm. No, sorry. Okay, let's head home. Um, check on the kitty witties. And I also gave Lamasi a little bit of a makeover. Um, I've given her, I mean, we were thinking of maybe giving, giving her like short hair, shaven head, a few of you guys said. Um, but in the end, I wanted her to have curly hair because I wanted to use the new curly hair from the Sims 4 Bowling Stuff Pack. And she's kind of got this flirty feminine style. It's got a bit of a 50s twist about it. I don't know. I thought that was cool. And I thought if we combine that with tattoos, that would be a nice, unique kind of look um, that we haven't really explored in this yet. So I think we'll start getting her some tattoos soon. I thought... I thought she would suit that. And I think Nita would be pretty cool about it because she's got a tattoo and obviously maybe Topaz and his daughter could get matching or something. Uh, that would be really nice. But anyways, this is the new house. I'm just going to put these two straight to bed because they are absolutely exhausted. Uh, Lamasi, I mean, I feel like, uh-oh. Oh, no. She didn't do a very good job looking after the kids, did she? Hmm. Oh, dear. I think we need to change your diaper. We'll get Lamasi to do that. And then I think we should put the two toddlers to bed. Aww, alchemy, come on. Come on. Lamasi's being babysitter tonight. She's a good girl, she's a good girl. Uh, but anyways, whilst we do that, <laughs> look at them in their little PJs. Okay, so this is the apartment. So if I'm gonna put the walls up and do a little bit of an apartment tour. Uh, so we go through the door. Woo! So this is the lounge room. Uh, obviously, they've had a little bit of help financially from the Margie Trust Funds, which comes in handy a lot in this LP. But they've got this really cool like TV area. Uh, down the corridor is the master bedroom, which we'll go to in a second. But this is like a nice little kitchen area. It's very like open plan. So you can kind of sit up there whilst you watch someone cook. And then it's got... Lots of artsy things around there, creative things, a bit of an industrial feel about it. And then a uh, small little desk area. And then through here is the toddler's room. So it's pretty big. It's a pretty big space um, for the toddlers, which is nice. And then in here we have the main bathroom. And then if we go down to the end, I don't know why she's putting them in the high chair. This is Lamasi's room. Uh, nice and artsy. I think it's really cute. She definitely does look like the daughter of Topaz and Nita, uh, which is nice. And then this is the master bedroom, which is probably my favorite. I love the blue carpet. I love the blue walls and a couple of Moroccan things around the place. Um, and then they have this little like yoga relaxation area where it's got some incense and tea light candles. So you can do your little yoga routine but that's pretty much the house um so that's available on the gallery to download uh okay lamasi i mean she's she's actually doing really well uh, sleep wise so it where okay so she is she's sad 
because someone smashed the dollhouse. Aww. <laughs> so sweet. So, 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 so sweet. Can you just, you know what? Let's just get the toddlers into bed. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Okay, let's just keep that in there. Let's get you. Are you stanky? Are you stanky, girl? Let's just put you to bed. I just think. Just hop into bed. Oh, okay, girl. Uh, now you need to get something to eat. Uh, oh my god. You guys told me this in the build video, which I'll also link. Um, I forgot a fridge. <laughs> Why is it that I always forget the fridge? I don't know. I just, it's just like impossible for me not to. I do this every single build almost. Let's get this in here. Um... So they live pretty comfortably, but it's not like they have stacks of money. They obviously have a house that's worth a lot. So if they ever needed quick money, they could move. Actually, I don't mind the red fridge. Mm, maybe not with the orange wall. We'll do brown to match that uh, kitchen. There we go. Excellent. It's 7 a.m. And I'm guessing that we do have school. In 55 minutes. Oh, she's a B student. Nice one. That's always good to see. She can have some quick cereal and she's going to be in a pretty good mood today. Okay, two pass. <laughs> bad mood, bad mood. Let's get you up. Let's get you to the toilet and a quick shower and then go put you back to bed. Because you don't. Yeah, it's working three days. You've got a few days off, so he's going to be fine. Uh, Nita is a stay at home mom, so she doesn't have to worry too much. Uh, she can just keep sleeping. Mm. That's so good. I wouldn't mind getting a nanny. I feel like the toddlers are so hard to take care of. I'm so glad I'm not doing like the 100 toddler challenge. Oh, how cute is this? Lamassi just looking after her little sister. Aw. I can't believe Lamassi has tan skin, black hair, and blue eyes. That's pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. Like, it's uncommon. It, I mean, it's not uncommon, but it's not as common if you've got like black hair to have blue eyes. Anyone who has that, I, I am jealous of you. That's a that's a beautiful, beautiful set of colors and high contrast. I love that. All right, so Lamasi is ready for school. Yay! And here's one of her outfits. So wearing that new skirt from the Sims 4 bowling stuff pack with like the poppies on it. And I don't know, I think she looks really sweet. So she's gonna hopefully have a good day at school and um we'll make sure that she do you want her to make friends hello topaz who's nike uh we'll get her to study hard i think um that sounds good and then these guys are just gonna sleep it off sleep it off well we might check into um the other household i think let's check on barbie and the gang okay we are back at the barbie dream penthouse nice one and um oh who's up here gem's having a little a little man bath up there, up there on the roof. I feel like he'd definitely love doing that. And he is off to work today. Uh, he's been doing really well at work recently. He is, yeah, hopefully, hopefully going to get uh, a promotion. I mean, assume, I assume so, but he has not filled out his reports and he could be in a better mood. So fingers crossed that doesn't affect um, the, pr the likelihood of a promotion. But I did give him a new hair from the new stuff pack as well. I think he looks really... Really, really uh, nice with that hair, but I wish he did wear a different suit to work. He looks very sloppy in that. Uh, I would not be happy Ooh, if I were Barbie. Huh. And what is this girl wearing? I don't... I did not pick that as an outfit for you. Please change into one of your beautiful new outfits. There we go. I love those more <laughs> colors. Anyways, um, so Pearl... Uh, the principal is calling. Mim she didn't go to school. That is so unlike Pearl. Maybe she stayed boy. home because her little brother was With sick. Sana I mean, Pearl would never be late for school. How is she going, actually? She's a C student. I feel like she's so much better than that. Doesn't look like the teacher was that upset. Well, let's maybe... I mean, how's her mood today? Her mood's amazing. Well, let's just go to school, I guess. Oh, love that outfit, too. That's from the new... Well, at least that top's from the new stuff pack. I'm not, I can't remember where those pants are from, but I do like that. Uh, so Onyx is at school. Let's study hard. Uh, Pearl, study hard. Actually, who did Onyx? How's Onyx going? Oh God, Kelly's gone bald again. That alopecia, she just can't get rid of, can she? That's okay though. Uh, 
Onyx. I'm just trying to remember. Did he have any love interests? We really need a we really need a love interest for him. Oh, I Miara. feel. <laughs> um, you know what? Instead of studying hard, let's make some friends. Let's see if he can meet uh, someone. That would be really good. And Ken, I was thinking, um, Ken's kind of having a little bit of a midlife crisis. You guys really want him to have a midlife crisis. So I put him in this new amazing ah. outfit because he's decided to take up bowling. And so he's got like his full on bowling outfit. And he's got like a llama unicorn thing on the back. So I think Bobby's like, oh my God, Ken, darling. Oh, what have you done? Oh my god. <laughs> you look great, honey. <laughs> and I think he should share a secret with Bobby and excitedly tell her that Bobby I'm starting a bowling team and I want you to be part of it and we can wear matching tops. It's my most amazing idea. It's like oh. Well, I guess, I mean, I guess we just pay people to look after the store, so I guess I have so much time on my hands. Now the kids are a bit older too, except for these guys. Oh, so they are going to have a bowling club. But I was thinking what would be really fun is if Ken put a bowling a bowlerama into their dream penthouse. Don't you think that would be cool? Um... So the man cavers, I'm going to change them to the, I think we should change the man cavers to the bowling club. Bowl, bowling, bowling club. Actually, let's call it the unicorn llamas. Um, yeah, so. They just need to be a little bit older. That's fine. And their new activity is going to be bowling. So let's let's remove these. I mean, they can still, um, you know, have pub games. Actually, no. We'll just say they do enjoy a drink, but I want them to go bowling. Fun and games. Go bowling. Woo! Okay, so that's what they're going to do. Oh, my God. Look at Malcolm. He's so cute. And uh, I think we're going to invite Barbie to the club because Ken wants his his little lady to um to join as well uh okay so let's put that down there and let's think about how we can incorporate a a bowling alley into this house i mean my instant thought is is to have it on the roof because can we do a basement in a penthouse i assume we can but i'm not sure oh no we can't huh I think we're going to have to put the bowling alley up here, which is kind of awkward because it means people have to go upstairs to go bowling right near the man tub. Uh, otherwise, we could put the bowling here. I mean, this is a nice elongated area. Sorry, uh, we're going to have to get rid of this lovely chess table, which is a bit sad. Oh, we can put that over there. Get rid of the yoga mat. Uh, probably, oh, I like the hedges though. They're so cute. Let's see. Let's get the bowling lane inactive oh gosh i really hope it fits okay that's a little bit larger than i, <laughs> than I expected holy dolly all right let's let's bring this back a little bit uh let's do some extensions renovations ken's dipping into his retirement funds i think um but shh, don't tell him that he's retired because he'll be really upset Okay, so we put that back a little bit. Uh, I think it should fit. Is that enough space? Oh, good grief. Okay, let's get rid of these little pot plants. Uh, I might need to put on the move objects cheat. I'm not sure. Oops. Place that. What? Can't intersect other objects. Ah, uh, it's not liking me today, is it? Okay, let's get rid of these. Then. Surely it's gonna fit now. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at that. They. I, I feel like this needs to be indoors because this looks like it's just not meant to be rained on. Am I right? <laughs> Maybe we'll do like a semi undercover type of deal. Uh, we can extend this out a little bit. Just like that. Yeah. So we still have that lovely pinky kind of a Thing. Don't ever stop 
don't let anyone stop you from doing your thing, girl. I think that's from Mean Girls, is it? Oh. Okay, so that's like that. I mean, it's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. Um, and then in terms of the outside of it, I think we keep it, keep it simple and quiet. And then, I don't know, I feel like we need windows. Like, I think an outdoor, indoor bowling lane is kind of a cool idea. The purple doesn't really go with the house. I think we have to go blue. Well, how sick is that? This place just became that much more awesome. If you don't mind me saying myself. Okay, and we want pink. Yes. Okay, this is beautiful. This is a masterpiece. Okay, now this alley though, like, I feel like it should actually be a cross one. You know what? I know what we're doing. We're gonna go like this. We're gonna go like that. Serious renovations Ken has had to organize. <laughs> okay, I'll put that in there. Um, cool beans. I think that'll be fine. I don't actually mind this little insert in there because we can add in some extra light there with another window. And maybe we'll go. Oh, oh good grief. I don't know what I was doing there. Okay, so what colors do we have? We have orange, blue, yellow. That is a pinky color. I think we're definitely going to have to go with the pink. I mean, do we even have to, like, is that even a question? <laughs> uh, this is the Barbie Let's Play. And then we can put some nice lights going down here. Amazing. Yay. Ken's Bowling Alley. Woo. Oh, and, and, uh, oh, we have zero club points. Buy club perks? Oh no, we need club points. I want us to get jackets. I want jackets, but we can't get jackets, can we? How many points do we need to get jackets? I've totally forgotten. Um, where, where, club perks, here we go. We need 200. Okay, we've got a little while to go. That's all right, well let, let's start a gathering and have a little bit of fun. I mean, these guys, you know, they're, they don't really do that much. <laughs> Barbie again. I mean, what do they do with their lives, really? They just, like, look after the kids, keep making babies. And when they're not making babies, they, they need to have an activity. I'm so proud we had twins, though. And also, Ken must be so close to finishing that rocket science skill. I can't believe how long it's taking us. Okay, so... Where's all the friendly men? Are they gonna... And Barbie... Also, Barbie, we're gonna have to give you. A, we're, we're gonna have to give you a, a top. But let's just have. Oh yeah, oh yes, we have our first bowling man. Woo! Jabby sooner. Jabby sooner. I mean, it wasn't really the best bowl, but hey, that's not bad for your first shot. It didn't go in the gutter. Good job. I don't think toddlers have an interaction on this. No. Be cute if they would like crawl down there and then a parent would have to go pick them up. But this is what we want. And everyone's gonna be like, uh -huh. Ken's gonna want the pink shirt. And everyone's gonna be like, oh man. He's like, well, if you wanna use my bowling alley for free, then you play by my rules, boys. <laughs> All right, so Bobby's gonna join too and add Moonlight Bowling upgrade. We need to have level five handiness skill. Hmm. What? handiness do we have? Yeah. Wow. We're a little bit handy. Oh no, we're we only level two. What about Jim? Did he get handy? Uh, oh, he's only level one. What about the gals? Oh. Are they handy at all? One. No. Oh well, that's okay. Uh, bowling skill acquired. Yay, Ken's gonna become so good at bowling. It's gonna be so exciting. Anyways, you guys, I'm gonna leave this part right here. Oh. Um, oops, they're kind of almost matching in those tops. But anyways, I'll leave this part right here. I hope you guys are having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. And I'll speak to you soon. Oh, and also leave out ideas for Ken's midlife crises. What else can he do? Get a tattoo? Oh, Kenny boy. <laughs> anyway, anyway, guys, I'll speak to you soon.